Good Monday collab coats. So once again, I find myself unsure of what to talk about, but I will respond to some things from last week. First off, Nikki, I thought your video was hilarious and I really liked your impression of me. It was, it was pretty good. Alex, yeah, for my career test, I couldn't even get to a list of suggested careers, not even, you know, one or two, but it gave me, oh, these are your traits. And then it's like to see what jobs suit those traits, you need to pay so much money. And then I just got frustrated and quit. What else? Look how long my hair is getting. I need a haircut. I feel like when we started this, my hair was probably like here. It's a couple inches. I haven't gotten my hair cut since April, fun fact, because I've been growing out my bangs and I didn't want to get my hair cut until I got all my bangs cut. Let's see how they are. And they're, yeah, they're about here now. So I can get it cut. I can get my hair cut short again. Because I like it that way. And yeah, I'm just wearing a hat because I didn't like how my hair was looking today. But that's not that bad. Oh well. Putting the hat back on. I also had more things I wanted to say to Alex because I feel like, especially in just where we all are in our lives and you know, it's just a big topic of discussion, what you want to do with your life and all that. Recently, a friend posted this video on Facebook and it was a TED talk, if you guys have ever heard of those, about... It was a TED talk about why you will never have a good career. And it sounds pessimistic, I know, but it was sort of really inspiring and funny and just really interesting. So I'll put a link in the description if you want to go check it out. I feel like it would be beneficial. Alex, you, you might really find it interesting. And I know Chelsea was having some hard times with the whole career stuff, so you might be interested. And Alex, you asked us if we had any sort of suggestions or whatever for, I guess, what to do with your life or something. I'm not sure how you phrased it. So yeah, my advice to you, Alex, is either A, become a master of archery because that would be awesome. And you know, like you said, like all things, it sort of takes hard work and practice, but I think you could do it and it would be pretty awesome and badass and people would be like, oh, what do you do? And you'd be like, I'm a master of archery and it would just be awesome. My other advice is just to find something you love and don't settle for any less because then what's the point? Which I know is not as easy as it sounds, but who said life was easy? It's about taking chances, making mistakes and getting messy. I still haven't got my TIFOs in the mail. It's sad. Are you guys going to read The Fault in Our Stars? Have any plans to? Have you read it already? No spoilers, please. I've been so wary of going on the internet this past week on like Tumblr and your pants and stuff because I just, I don't want to see any spoilers. So I have an idea for a theme next week. Now that I've got my camera, I'm excited to do a bit more fun stuff. Anyway, so I have a theme for next week if people are open to it. I was hoping to do a teach something week so everyone picks something that they're interested in or from their major or whatever and makes a video teaching everyone about it for the week. All right, bye. <laughs>